hyde i would like now if the attorney general would stand to be sworn in please you raise your right hand do you swear or affirm that the testimony you're about to give should be the truth the whole truth and nothing but the truth thank you clearly a dangerous situation was becoming more dangerous especially for the children we had received allegations that koresh had sexually abused the children in the past including carrie jewel when she was just 10 years old we had also received allegations that koresh had physically abused the children for example, a former Davidian alleged that Koresh had once spanked a young child for 40 minutes so hard that her bottom was bleeding. The child was only eight months old. And I think it's important as, as we go. Another explosion, goodness. Another tremendous explosion on the south end. It's gone. to resolve the situation. Everyone involved in the events of April the 19th made their best judgments based on all the information we had. This was the hardest decision I have ever had to make, probably one of the hardest decisions that anybody could have to make. It will live with me for the rest of my life. I'm accountable for it, and I'm happy to answer your questions. Thank you very much, Ms. Reno not to make statements like that that can cause the confusion. These tanks were used to protect FBI agents who were on the front line, who were exposed to men who had killed four FBI agents, who had, ATF agents who had wounded 15, who we knew were armed with very high-powered weapons. I don't think you would want them to be unprotected, Mr. Chairman. Clinton on the same day, April 21, 1993. And the last one, the buck stops here. And I quote, the acting attorney general con uh, concurred fully with your philosophy regarding this matter and assured me that no significant action would be taken without White House approval, unquote. But we advised him based on a law enforcement judgment, not a political judgment, not a judgment of the White House, but the decision was made in the law enforcement arena where it should be. You indicated that Mr. Altman had walked away from a briefing. No, uh, no fire engines, no uh, sirens, except for uh, three uh, vehicles coming in here about uh, five minutes ago with flashing lights. They, uh, certainly no one hospital is going to be able to handle the numbers of potential uh, injury victims here.